comfortably all night long. Denver Mattress, the easiest way to get the right ceiling. Well, thank you so much for sticking with us here on NBC 23 and joining us this morning is Alan Garces. Now he's the downtown manager for the city of Brownsville. We're excited to have him here because he has some great Happy information here. about some events that Danielle's always excited about Christmas. Oh, you have no idea. I talk about Christmas every single day of my life and so I'm very <laughs> excited about this. Adam and I are actually going to be doing something together courtesy of your invitation. Absolutely. What's going on tomorrow? Absolutely. No, I'm so excited <laughs> you guys had me here today. Thank you for having me. So of course, like you guys said, you're going to be there. So tomorrow evening, downtown Browns where we're going to have our market square tree lighting ceremony <laughs> right cool. so we've been doing this a little bit after COVID this is our third year it's getting bigger and better and like you said you guys are gonna be there so it's gonna be super awesome I'm glad you guys uh, accepted the invite yeah it's gonna be so great grateful. I encourage everybody to check it awesome. out awesome now <laughs> you had one um, the last one you had tell us what that experience was like right so we had performances from our local ISDs we also had a charter schools participate we also had local talent from the downtown community mm -hmm. um, as a matter of fact this past year it was scheduled from six to nine and now we've received more participation participation requests to where it's extended so now we're going from six to nine thirty right so more people are getting involved yeah. more community members um, it's about showcasing our local talent right yeah. so that's exactly what we're doing you guys are gonna be part of it as well <laughs> there she's real big on we, we all are supporting local talent mm -hmm. yeah, yeah no I'm very excited about this because it's a family friendly occasion 100%. there's gonna be food there's gonna be live music and plus Christmas how many times can I say it right you're gonna get a visit <laughs> from Santa right all the Christmas lights wow. I mean over a hundred thousand lights the wow. market square is gonna be decorated guys That's please cool. check this out yeah. it, like I mentioned earlier it's growing we see more decor than the other well, previous years mm -hmm. more lights again you see Santa there on the screen Thank he's you. gonna be there to take pictures with the kiddos that's that tree. And Tell me about the tree. How tall is this tree and what does it take to put this up? Oh my goodness. So you're looking at about a 30 or 40 foot tree. Yeah. Um, and we've actually had received a lot of help from the local community. One of our local developers actually, uh, Rhodes Enterprises, came and, and helped us and volunteered to set that up. So it, it's about that community partnership. And like I said, it's about showcasing our local talent. So they're able to, to recognize that and say, they, hey, I want to be a part of that. So of course, they did that for free and we are truly appreciated of that. Awesome, Alan, it sounds like it's going to be a great event. I've seen the progress of Market Square getting yeah. additional lights, growing 100%. the tree going up. What else can people expect to see tomorrow night? Okay, so I mentioned Santa's going to be there. Mm -hmm. There's going to be a different type of dancing performances. We got Ooh. drum lines. We have estudiantinas, folkloricos. We're going to have mariachis. I mean, there's different types of uh, performances that you guys can expect. Uh, I will say that we will also have a closing performance. Clearly, Casala will be there. It's going to be it's going to be a fun night. Uh, we also have uh, food vendors from the local downtown restaurants that are going to be there. So get your tacos, get your get your free, get some food there, um, <laughs> some pizza from the beaches, etc. But I will also say that it's going to be a really, really fun event and we'll have also free hot chocolate for the kiddos. So Aww. show up, enjoy yourselves, have a great time, spend uh, your time in some of the restaurants, some of the local nightlife there. It's going to be a good time. And I happen to notice this is all taking place on East Adams oh, Street. That's right, that's right, yes. <laughs> so Absolutely. you got to be there yeah. for sure. Yeah. So <laughs> before we move on, tell everybody, you know, where they can go to see this. Absolutely. What's the location, the times? This is your time to invite everyone. Okay, <laughs> City of Brownsville and Rio Grande Valley, please come check that out this event. It's going to be at Market Square in downtown Brownsville. That's at the corner of East Adams and 11th Street. And the event starts at 6 p.m. and runs all the way until 9.30 p.m. Wow, so excited. Thank Please you check it out, everybody. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Alan, for being here this Thank morning. Thank you for having we me. appreciate it. Yeah, but we'll be out there for sure. So we'll see you guys there tomorrow at 6 o'clock. Sure. Well, if you or your organization would like to come on the show and speak about an event or community initiative, we'd love to have you join us in the studio. You go over to valleycentral.com, click on the News tab, and you'll see the guest submission contact form. After you fill that out, hit the submit button and we'll get in contact with you about scheduling an 